When we live with dogs, we can make things happen, watch things happen, react to things that happen, or wonder what happened. You choose. Whenever I hear someone fussing at their dog, I'm reminded of the scene from the movie Driving Miss Daisy. Here, here, you took the wrong turn at all for life. Well, now you took it with me, Miss Daisy. And you got the map. Remember, you're responsible for the map and directions. Understand, dogs are scavengers, they're opportunists, they bark, they dig, they chew, they're attracted to scents, and many like to chase things. We can't fix normal, and we can't make dogs something they're not, but we can make improvements. The goal of training is to put those behaviors under our control. Our goal is to add brakes and power steering. Many have a disposition to run and chase things. We can teach our dogs to wait and not chase, and we can teach them to come when called. Come and come. Nice job, buddy. Good boy, right here, right here. Good man. Our training focus is on behavior and cooperation. Behavior and cooperation is a function of training, not genetics. But dog training needs to be more than a mechanical skill. Poor training motivates transactions and often results in indifferent or fearful dogs. Whereas good training builds relationships and results in engaged, happy dogs. Dog behavior can be placed in one of two buckets. Dogs do what they've been taught, intentionally or unintentionally, or what we allow them to do. Things like pulling on leads, jumping, getting in the trash, digging, etc. Jumping up is often unintentionally taught. Note that dogs do what works. They repeat those things that result in favorable outcomes. Dogs are always learning with or without our participation. They do take notes. Every circumstance is noted whether it results in positive or negative results. Don't expect dogs to grow out of problem behaviors. If you're not actively involved in working through those issues, dogs will continue to grow into those behaviors, not out of them. But with time and training, things should get a lot easier by the time dogs reach adulthood. How challenging the first two years will be depends on the structure and training dogs receive early in life. 